Hey there guys, it's Jack and I'm back again with another video and I just want to say welcome to this tutorial. Today's video I'm showing you guys how you'll be able to go on Minecraft Pocket Edition Realms via Pocket Mine Realms. Okay, so I'm logged in and everything, I don't have any realms because again it's in beta. But what you're going to do is, this works on Android and iOS, no jailbreak needed, anything. I'm on iPad 2, not jailbroken because I got it on 6.1.3. Okay? So what you're going to do is you're going to go to Safari and you're going to go to the link in the description. If you don't care to click the link and you want to type it in yourself, you're going to go to realms.pocketmine.com. Okay? You're going to click iOS or Android. Either way, it's just going to scroll you. You know, there's, for me, it's next by, right next to each other. So what you're going to do, if you're on iOS, you're going to, or Android, both of them, you're going to click Install Certificate or Profile. It'll open up Settings. I'm going to click Install install done now you can either do this for your DNS or you can do this for proxy which is how I'm gonna do it DNS you just copy it and then you're gonna go into settings you're gonna go to Wi-Fi and I'll change it for American because I have so many freaking Wi-Fi connections in this house so in my case, I'm going to go to auto, and I'm going to type you, I'm going to go to the URL, and I'm going to paste. Okay, so that's how we will be able to connect. Or you guys can replace it in DNS. I won't be doing that, though, in my case, because I prefer the proxy sometimes. So now, after that, you're going to open up Minecraft PE. You'll see these. You're going to want to tap this. You're going to get this error. And then you go to play on realms again, and now there's a bunch of realms that'll show up. Some of them don't work, some of them do. It's just if people set their server up. So I'm just going to click this one, and we'll see if this server will let me connect. Because um, not all of them do allow you to connect due to connection to the server and stuff like that. And this one's taking too long, so let's see. What's one that I was able to connect to yesterday? Um, normally the ones that'll let you connect are the ones that have people on them. Um, let's see if this one will let me. No. Well, I'm going to try one more and if it doesn't work, um, I'll, tr I'll choose this one. If it doesn't work, then, you know, eventually, you know, for you guys it should work. You know, it normally works for me. Um, but then again, like I said, it's connection to the server because these people might be able to connect, but I can't it's type of a thing. And I do plan on eventually hosting a server via this, depending on price of hosting one by them. Okay, there's one last one that we're going to try. Let's see if this will work. Well, unfortunately, it's not letting me connect to any of the servers I just tried, but I promise one of them would, um, well, multiple of them would. There's, you know, as you guys can see right now online, there's quite a few servers um, that it could let me join. Um, we'll pick this last one. We'll see, because there's a lot of people on this one, so it might let me connect. Um, yep, it's letting me connect and everything, so really quick, we'll do that. And I can show you guys it works, you know, chat works, everything. And this is, you know, completely legal. It's within Mojang's terms, but you have to be on Wi-Fi. It won't work on 3G or 4G or any of that kind of stuff if you're on an iPhone. Now, my understanding is this will work with any operating system. Don't hold me to that. So, I'm currently standing in somebody, and it's loading chunks fairly slow, but it's a creative server. So, as you see, um, it works perfectly fine. You can see everybody. You see everybody's name tags. So yeah, that was just, you know, showing you guys, you know, right there, that's the list of every single person on the server. There's a lot of people. This person must have a pretty good freaking server. <laughs> so yeah, guys, like I said, this will work on iOS or Android. You just have to follow the instructions 
Now, if you are jailbroken, you can go and you can add cydia.entire.nl to your Cydia sources, and it will set everything up for you. Um, so, yeah, pretty much. Um, that works. Uh, that's all the instructions for um, Android. Unfortunately, I don't have an Android running Pocket Edition on it, so I can't test this. Um, but my understanding is it does work due to how many people are having a good time doing this kind of stuff, so, yeah, thank you guys very much for watching, it means a lot to me, if this tutorial helped you out, let me know in the comment section below, thank you so much for watching, have a great day.